All right, Machia. It's up to you to take on an endless horde of cavalry reinforcements. I know the odds are stacked against you, and it doesn't seem very good. But just understand, you're built different. You're built better. God, if you can hear me, please do not let her die. There is no meme. This is just a threat. Welcome back to Fire Emblem for Sedica. Why, why can you talk to Karen? What? Okay, I guess we're just starting right out the gate with some new stuff. Such swift acrobatics. That really does take me back. Huh? Uh, sir? Are you alright? Oh, did Hermes here give you a weird look? Hermes, you should know better than that. My apologies. I didn't mean to stare like that. And your steed is a beautiful one. It's just that seeing your maneuvers reminded me of a woman I once fought alongside with, long ago. Is that right? Wow, that's really an honor. Who was this woman? Maybe there's a chance I know her. The queen had introduced me to many knights. Wait, please excuse me. I'm not at liberty to be asking you stuff like that on the spot. Pay it no mind. Do you refer to Queen Araness of Solis? How does her majesty fa- Oh yeah, Finn would care if she died. I never thought about that. But... Yeah, wait. Finn would have an awkward conversation about Aranus dying, just like said. I never thought about that. I understand. I apologize again. I did not mean to open such a delicate subject. Oh, no, no, it's fine. I just... I thought I'd finally put it all behind me, but... What do you mean you put it all behind me? She died, and then you went to find said, and you've been thrown in prison. You have had no time to put it behind you. Your life has been a nightmare. But that's why I'm doing my best to grow stronger and make my country proud. I see. Well, take this as you may, seeing as we've just met. But I believe soon enough you'll flourish beyond Her Majesty's expectations. D do you really mean that? I don't know what to say. <laughs> It hurt my nose to sniffle that loud. I need to stop doing these bits. It's like whenever someone would cough or like go, Ack! I'd do it really loud and then I'd start actually hacking up a lung. I need to understand I'm not built for physical comedy. I'm not built for much, to be honest. What's your name? I'm Karen. Karen, a pleasure. My name is Finn. Nice to meet you, Sir Finn. And hey, I just unloaded some of my baggage. Maybe now you'd like to do the same? This woman that I reminded you of. What was she like? What was her name? I believe I'd best save that part for another time. <laughs> right. Now's not the time. Like, she just went, Oh man, I'm so sad that the queen is dead. Everything is bad. And Finn's like, Maybe, maybe now's an inappropriate time to bring up that I was referring to the queen. All right. The endless swarm of reinforcements continues. Mm-hmm. And you're gonna throw a javelin at Dalson. <laughs> Excellent work. Yep. You are winner. Oh dang it, he's gonna level up off of this. Okay, so you weren't scrolled up for it, but maybe it'll still be a good level up. I mean, his speed stat doesn't exist, but he's an armor knight. That's what I would expect. Alright. So I'm fairly certain I can just... Uh, yeah. I can get Karen in there, and then these cavaliers will start to flee. But before they start to flee... I would like to take this rapier. Ooh, strength and speed! Okay! Um... Right, and then Karen? Do I just, like, wait on that? Objective, have Leaf arrive at the exit point. 
Um, I believe this, yeah, this is the same. Lord Leaf, you are right. Mm -hmm, this is about the same. Uh-huh, yep, this is, this is the same. Do you not just have someone escape and then that triggers... Okay, I know, you just have to wait there. The Knights of Munster dared across the border? Raedric, do you hold me in such contempt as to attack so brazenly? Men of the Panzen Ritter, go fuck them up! God, he's so cool. Oh, I love him. He's so goddamn cool. Uh, Hannibal is one of my favorite characters. Alright, so now that Hannibal's taken the field, that is the trigger for these guys to F off and never return. Um... Hmm. With the rapier, yeah, you can kill this guy. And just because they're leaving me alone doesn't mean I can't, you know, take some experience. Very nice, very nice. Um, if Asbel kills this one, which I'm hoping he can, he'll need a lucky crit off of, um, his follow-up critical coefficient, but he can get that. He didn't get that. He didn't even hit. Okay. That's fine. Now, Finn... Oh, Nana can talk to Finn. That This is also the same. These are both things that always happened. Yep, he's always here to listen. Alright, this is the same. Got it. Uh-huh, right, this- okay, good, 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 good. Alright, nothing new there. I could have sworn... Oh, you know what, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, we're gonna get out of here. Um, don't think I forgot about this. I didn't. It's just going to be difficult. Honest to God, that might just be Shiva. I might send Shiva over to the left with the Killing Edge and all of the scrolls and just have him solo all of this. And maybe have Karen there to rescue and um, steal some men. Yeah, that might be what I want to do. Uh, looking at that. Alright, we hit end turn. Hannibal himself is taking the field? Of all that time for that doddering fool to show his face. All knights, fall back! Retreat to Munster! Right. And that's to show you they're not going to attack you anymore. They're just all set to flee. Now, I would like one of their rapiers. And by one of them, I mean, like, another one. I should be able to get another one. And then that is two for the convoy. And there is a conversation between Hannibal and Leaf. Which is very nice. This is new. Let's see how this goes. Your banner. Are you soldiers from Meath? Indeed. There appear to be quite the commotion. We marched out at once to address it. So, so we're finally safe. Hmm. My name is Hannibal. Under my protection, you may rest easy. Hannibal? As in the shield of Thracia? The renowned Thracian general? That is how his majesty acknowledges me, yes. But let us speak more in my castle. First, we'll send this stampede scurrying. Forgive my impatience. I'll leave you and your men to it. God, they added an entire conversation to remind you that Hannibal is him. If you're feeling lucky, why not head to the arena just south of here? 
If you compete there and win, you'll make out with a pouch of coin and a fair bit of experience. Oh, but all fights are to the death, so don't hesitate to yield by pressing the B button if things starting to go south. And, doing... and don't feel like you gotta clear out everybody inside, neither. Pacing yourself is more important than winning first place. Oh, and if your magic needs an extra edge, whether you're using it or defending against it, use this before you go inside. Alright, another pure water. Keep in mind that I have those. They are very useful. Alright, who currently has all the scrolls? Who Who is currently all scrolled up on a Tuesday afternoon? Who the hell has the scrolls? Hicks? No. Brighton, it's Brighton. Okay, Brighton. Trade over. Give him all those. Nana, you're going to go over here. Mm hmm. And this is just going to be the Shiva training arc. Daisy, or. God darn it, Daisy's not able to get there. But if she procs a movement star. Dang it. Okay. Well, it was worth a shot. Okay. She's moving everyone down. I mean, the arena is, like, the way to make money. But I don't have any money to bet in the arena. Which means I can't actually go fight in the arena. Because I am poor. And they don't let poor people fight. Uh-huh, all the NPCs are schmoovin'. Okay. Dismount. Dismount. Uh, Karen, just move over. Okay. What do you mean the Berserker with Wrath has a hand axe? Alright, that's actually going to make things more difficult. If I'm approaching from this direction... Mm. Oh, hey, I didn't know they made a movement tile for Fire Emblem 8. <laughs> hmm. Also, they surrounded Aspel, holy shit. Okay. I gotta sell something. And then I can fight in the arena. And make a billion dollars. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, Dawson has a fire tome he can give to... Um... Asbel. That might be interesting. Alright. They're all schmoovin' up. Mount, wait. Um, make sure that Shiva doesn't move too far forward. Because Fergus, armed with the flame sword, his attack speed is 10, your attack speed is 14, that's gonna double. What? Okay, what's my avoid right now? It's 57. And that's on a plane tile. If I move to the seven. Oh, that's um That's not good. That's not good at all. Hmm. This certainly does put a damper in things, doesn't it? Vendor. Um, I could sell this fire tome. And with that sold, I can though I can then go gamble that money in the arena. I'm so smart. Problem is everything else that's happening. That ah, gonna be a little difficult. Macha absolutely can't go that way, because her vantage will proc that dude's wrath, and then everything is just miserable.
Arena. What 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 do I have equipped on him? Item Equip Wind Arena. Not a twenty. Seven sixty? I'll do seven sixty. There we go. Asbel, baby, you're making me bank. Nice. I can use that to buy weapons at some point. This hit is 103. Your hit, your avoid is 42. But if we were to put you on a peak tile, that would drastically change. And your attack speed is 12, which isn't a... Okay, hang on. I I'm gonna just redo this entire plan. And instead drop him off up here. Where there is no Wrath Berserker with a ranged weapon waiting to kill him. You know what? Honestly, I might just say forget that entire left side. You know? I might honest to God say that it's not worth it and I should just take the peaceful way home. Arena. No, not 840. Not 850. Wait, hold on. Oh, it doesn't take away my weapon experience. Okay. Or my weapon uses. Not paying 950. 810, maybe. 790. Um. Hold on. If I don't die in one hit. Oh, Adept's procking. You're really making me watch this. Alright. Got him. There we go. Never in doubt. I love gambling! Okay. I now... Yeah, and my wind tome doesn't go down in uses. Oh my god, I could give, um... Fergus the Brave Sword. And have him just go. That could be pretty good. I'm making money! Shiva, just continue to fly over there. Mm-hmm. God damn it, he can reach him even there. But I honest to God feel like that's also 40% dodge. I think that's safe enough to put Shiva there? I've ruined everything for Dumber. You headed for Tara, anti-toxin. Right. That is very relevant because poison in Thracia is way scarier than poison anywhere else. Alright. Oh, Shiva? Oh, right. For some reason I thought units could walk on the green peaks. They can't. Or, no, these units can. Because, you know, they're brigands. Bandits. Okay. Oh, no, no. It's not what it looks like. I can explain it all. Just don't take me in. I beg you, please. Eh? Not the castle guards? Give me the master seal. That's right. I remembered what that item was. Alright. I would absolutely love for Shiva to get some experience. He doesn't exactly have to break the bank or anything. But I would really like it if he could get something. Alright. That's fine. Okay? Um... Ending the turn. The NPCs are all moving. This is just me versus my greed. How greedy am I? The answer will not surprise you. Because I am always the greediest SOB 
you've ever seen in your life. He doesn't have odd scroll because skill is something Shiva doesn't need help with. Shiva's skill is always just completely fine. Um, what level is Nana? Oh, you could, um, mm. Alright. Move you right there. Alright. Fergus! Wait, hang on. He needs to have the this equipped. Arena! That's too expensive. Ah, it's too expensive. That's too expensive. Too expensive. Too expensive. Wait, oh my god, Fergus will die instantly. Less than eight, like, or 800 or less. That's all I want. The, the secret to the arena is to be a bitch. Never pay for an expensive enemy. You will die. However, it looks like Fergus is not getting so blessed. Okay, like 820. Alright. Fergus, with his follow-up critical coefficient... Why did the Brave Sword only attack once? Why did the Brave Sword only attack once? Why did. What was his critical hit chance? Okay. Alright. You know what? Fuck the arena. Fuck the entire left side of the map. What just happened? How did Fergus get crit like that? I need to re-see that and see the odds. So, I've cracked the code of why everything went wrong. In the arena, you don't use what you walk in with, you use the weakest version of what you walk in with. So when Fergus walked in with the Brave Sword, and I thought he'd be kicking ass with the Brave Sword, the game went, wait, Fergus, Sword, Iron Sword. Now, that is how the arena works in the Game Boy Advance games. It is not how the arena works in Ugdrawl, specifically, not this one, by Ugdrawl I mean FE4. In FE4, you go into the arena with what you were using in the arena. And that... Ow. Oh, I'm good. And, because of that, I didn't realize I would lose the Brave Sword. Now, I could have noticed that with Asbel. Problem, I walked in with Asbel equipped with Wind. And the weakest version of Wind is Wind. So because of that, I didn't realize that I would lose the Brave Sword. And then I proceeded to get a critical hit. And really, I just spent a minute explaining what could have been summarized as I got greedy and got punished for being greedy. But I'm still going to blame the game, though. Are you going to get any stat other than skill? Like, yes, now you're not missing heals, but what are your heals going to do? Alright, well, regardless, I should have used the magic ring on her. I used it on Asbel. That was a mistake. I thought Nana would level up magic. At all. She didn't. Alright, none of this changes. We did it. The first death, and it was completely avoidable and my own fault. Go me. But we do have a new interim conversation. Ah, to no longer be on the run. I can finally be out outdoors and let my shoulders down. I resonate with your feelings. Now we can act again our against our adversaries on our own terms. It's quite the blessing. Yes, now that we can partake in proper inventory management, we'll be braced for anything. 
such a privilege will be invaluable to us. We also have traveling merchants accompanying us, should we need, and that's if we actually are able, to equip ourselves with new weaponry. But from here on out, my prince, we must also be- Okay, this is just explaining fatigue. Got it. Little point in discussing that, our wisest and most- Yep, okay, this is- This is serving to give an in-universe explanation to the fatigue system. Alright. So! I need Leaf in there. Finn is pretty much essential for capturing that guy. Osian and Halvin are back. Ronan's back. A lot of you guys are fatigued. Oh, my healer's fatigued. It's because I was just making fun of her, wasn't it? Alright. So the next map is an indoors map. So I'm going to want... Any, uh, mounted units... To be used here. Who is more important? Fergus or Karen? Um... I mean, there's a lot of axe units. So I'm gonna want to deploy, um... Fergus. Got it. Am I able to move units around? Nope. Okay, so they did not change that. In Thracia, deployment order dictates... Uh... When and where you're allowed to put people. Now it's time to watch me think about items and trade them around. Golly, wasn't that a, such a joy to watch me navigate all those menus? Alright. So, this chapter is always kind of designed to be a break. The last few chap- like, you just finished the Manster Escape arc. You just had to go through so much stuff. Now, you've got some weaker units. Ronin and the fighters aren't going to be as leveled up as everyone else. And you're just here to take it a bit easy. And for new conversations that are added in Forsetti's Cut. Lord Leaf. Are you alright? Halvin? I'm doing well. Is there something wrong? You looked worried. I apologize. That was not my intention. No, it's perfectly fine. I guess I'm just not used to it yet. Used to what? Do you think I've changed? I wouldn't say changed. More like you've taken up a new role. A new role. Well, to be frank, everything you've been doing lately is behavior I associate with... Avail. You miss her, Halvin. A lot. I know I definitely do. It's... It's taken some getting used to. Just like you, Lord Leaf. Commander Avail acted as our parent after ours were lost to the Empire. You and your sister. Right. I... I didn't just lose a comrade in all of this. I lost family. So, I'm in this as much as you are. I just wanted to make sure you knew that. I never doubted your commitment, Halvin. Although, it does feel good to hear you speak on it. It helps me feel worthy of your support. Thank you for that. It's an honor, Lord Leaf. I'll always be on your side. That's lovely. That's good. Osian, what do you have to say? Hey, Leaf. Got a second? Sure, Osian. Something you need? Sort of. I wanted to say sorry for getting into it with those guards at Meath. Well, it's more like they wanted me to say sorry for the embarrassment I must have caused you. So, anyway, uh, yeah. Did General Hannibal release the wrong of Cyan? What the, what the hell's that mean? Okay, good. You're the right Osian. I'm sorry, I just... I'm not at all used to hearing you... Well, apologize. Yeah, har har. Real funny. I'll have you know, I didn't apologize as Osian. I did it as your trusty comrade, Prince. Don't get me wrong. I've got my own opinions and methods for all we do. But I recognize and rectify insubordination when I see it. I figured I ought to personally let you know that. Ah, I see. Either way, thank you. You're welcome. Now, how about we smash these thugs and clear the way to Dagdar's Manor? I got a few things to say to Tanya. And I shall leave you to it. I'm counting on you, my trusty comrade. Hm. Alright, that was nice. Oh, by the way, Kalyan's here. There he is. The, uh, the Cavalier. Ah, oh, shoot. Is there a supply here? 
There isn't. I meant to give Marty... Does, does Marty need Paragon? Couldn't hurt. And the sooner you use Paragon, the better. I just... I'm not sure who I want to have use Paragon. But the longer I dilly-dally, the more useless the Paragon scroll becomes. There's Gomez. One of the best, if not the best, one-off Fire Emblem villains out there. Regardless, with the power of the forests, I'll never be poisoned. Excellent. Okay. Just dodge this. Thank you. Problem is, I don't... Not as fatigued... Normally, you'd have Safi. Because, you know, Safi wouldn't be dead. So you'd have her to heal for this map. But I don't have Safi. Which makes this entire map exponentially more difficult. I should still be fine. But it's something to consider. Oh, hey, Proct Adept. Nice. Ooh. You guys are getting experience real quick. What level's Osian? Level 6? Hmm. Alright. Um, who has all the scrolls right now? Fergus. Right. Just, just kill this man. Erase him as a concept from reality. That gonna be enough for Fergie to level up? No. Of course it wouldn't. Uh, bu 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 bum, bu 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 bum. All right. Here's how we're gonna do this. Trade with you. Get all the scrolls. Then trade with Osian. Give all the scrolls. Then, rescue Osian. Then, we arm Finn with the javelin, and then we take and we drop him on the forest tile, and all is right in the universe. Shiva moves over one, and then Halvin moves over, because I'm pretty sure he has a support bonus with Osian. He might not. There we go. Everything's coming up Millhouse. That is not who I wanted you to attack. Nothing is coming up Millhouse. Well, okay. That's not too bad. Alright. So as long as Finn doesn't get hit by this, because I definitely forgot to bring my antitoxins. And I know. I know the game made it very clear... That there are poison enemies around here. And I can see them. Okay, so I just did all that. And I'm going to have to give... The items back. Oh, god dang it. Okay. Um, who's the most likely... Ronin, right? Yes, okay. This might get him poison, but I got vulneraries. Who cares? Alright, all the scrolls. Attack with an iron bow. Alright, and if you don't kill him... Oh no, you're gonna kill him. Wow, I'm getting really lucky with these dodges. Nice. Now Ronin, with the quad scroll level up, is gonna pop the hell off. He did not pop the hell off. Alright, Marty. Alright. So what we're gonna do is equip the rapier and then give the scrolls back. My greed knows no bounds. And then put you right there. Marty's gonna walk up and attack you with the hand axe. And because of that, I'm going to be able to talk and recruit him. Talk to and recruit him. Shiva, you can go up here and deal with that menace. 
Hicks can be there for emotional support. Leaf. And then Kalyan. And Finn. Alright. This is gonna go great. Unless Shiva gets hit and dies somehow. There we go. You know what? Maybe I'll use Trude this run. That has nothing to do with what just happened. I just saw Myrmidon and thought, yes, Trude. Alright, Fergus just barely wasn't able. Alright. Let's get you back. <laughs> this is really funny. He hasn't recognized you. Wait for an opening. Oh, hey, Marty! Alright, he's on our team again. Yes. Um. Yep. Yeah. Marty is back. And watch. As he totally has not much of a chance to hit anything. But. Look who does have a chance. To capture people. And then not actually be. Wait a minute. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Marty, with the Hand Axe, can weaken him. Okay. That is fantastic. We get Marty out of the way. Ronin, you can attack, you can weaken, and then I can capture that Venom Axe guy so that I can get an Iron Axe which is what Venom Axes become, because God hates having fun. We're not allowed to poison enemies. But at least Fergus will get his quad scroll level up at last. So, Fergus, show us what you got. Scrolls don't do shit. 